Hello, boys and girls. This is Aunt Fernita, and I have a wonderful story for you, called "One Said Thank You." Today's memory verse is from Psalm 30, verse 12. It says, "God, I will give you thanks forever." God, I will praise you forever. God, I will praise you forever. Psalms thirty verse twelve. The message for today's story is: We worship Jesus when we thank Him. Have you ever given something special to someone who did not say thank you? How did that make you feel? A long time ago, Jesus helped some men get better. What do you think they did? Jesus and his disciples walked toward Jerusalem. Along the way, they came to a small village where ten men called to him from a distance. Jesus, Master, have pity on us. Jesus knew they had leprosy. They had sores on their face, or on their hands, or even on their feet. People with leprosy might cut their foot and not know it. They could burn their finger and not feel it at all. But that was not the worst part. In Jesus's time, lepers could not live in the village with their families. That's because they might give their families or other people leprosy. People would go outside the village and set food out for the people with leprosy, and then run away. If someone came close by accident, the lepers had to shout, "Unclean, unclean," and hurry off in the other direction. These ten lepers had heard about Jesus. They knew that he had made many people well, and they wanted him to make them well too. That's why they called out to Jesus. Jesus loved them, and he wanted to help them, so he said, "Go show yourselves to the priest at the temple." In Jesus's time, it was the priest who decided who had leprosy. It was also the priest who could decide if the person was healed and could go back to live with their families. Even though the men still had leprosy, they did exactly what Jesus told them. They headed straight for the priest. And as they went along, they were healed. The sores on their hands, on their faces, and on their feet were gone. Their skin was nice and soft and new. They could feel their feet again. They could run. They could not wait to see the priest. Soon they would be able to go home again. Jesus and his disciples watched the men. Suddenly, one man stopped. He turned around. And began to run towards Jesus. He was shouting something. Was it unclean? Unclean? No. It sounded like praise God. Praise God. Praise him. Praise him. He ran back and fell down at Jesus's feet. "Thank you, Jesus," he said. "Thank you for making me well." Jesus smiled. 
He was glad the man was well, and he was glad that the man came back to say thank you. Jesus turned to his disciples. I know that there were ten men who were sick, and who are well now. Where are the other nine? Jesus loves to make people happy, and he loves to hear people say thank you. Have you told Jesus thank you today? Thank Him, thank Him, all ye little children. God is love, God is love. Thank Him, thank Him, all ye little children. God is love, God is love. Let's be like the man who said thank you.